Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Trace Maneville, and welcome to Bash TV. Today is Thursday, October 21st, making today the official 41st day of school and day one of the cycle. The lunch menu for today will be beef and cheese nachos, sliced bread, corn, mixed fruit, and milk. The breakfast menu for tomorrow will be cherry frutal, applesauce, assorted juice, and milk. SAT testing dates are scheduled for December 4th with the registration deadline of November 4th. Seniors, do you and your parents need help completing the FAFSA? Berwick High School Guidance Department will host a FAFSA completion night on Wednesday, October 27th. Pre-registration is required. Students and parents can sign up in the guidance office. Remember, any student wishing to receive financial aid to assist with the cost of higher education must complete the FAFSA. Juniors, if you, do not, if you did not receive a Krispy Kreme fundraiser sheet, please stop by to see Mrs. Eisenberg in room 49. The sale ends today. Sophomores, continue to sell those candles for your class fundraiser. Selling four candles meets your class dues for this year. All money and orders are due tomorrow. Money and orders can be given to either Mr. Thatcher in room 53 or Mrs. Whitner in room 34. Well, that's it for the main desk. Now let's hear from Connor with sports. Thanks, Trace. I'm O'Connor. Let's take a look at the scores from Tuesday and the sports for tonight. On Tuesday, in girls volleyball, CC Eisenberg recorded 29 kills and 17 digs, and Berwick defeated Western Wayne, winning three out of three sets. Morgan Neville had two kills, six aces, and 15 service points, along with Camille Pintridge's 20 digs and Kaylee Hacker's four kills. For tonight's sports, boys varsity soccer is home with Crestwood at 4:15 p.m. Now over to Daniel with FYI to see what's happening around BHS. Thanks, O'Connor. I'm Danny Dons, and let's get started with FYI. The Berwick Elks Lodge is looking for student volunteers to help set up and clean up for two upcoming events. Interesting, interested students should see Mrs. Curry in the guidance office. These event dates are Sunday, November 7th at 12 p.m. for the district dinner, and Thursday, November 11th at 4.30 p.m. for the Veterans Day dinner. Attention all students, a carnival at the FTC Teen Center in Berwick is offering a volunteer opportunity. The carnival will be held on Sunday, October 24th from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. There will be a bounce house as well as a variety of local food vendors and games that will need help throughout the event. If you are interested in receiving community service hours, please contact the Teen Center. Sophomores and freshmen, are you interested in being a part of Youth and Philanthropy? Would you like to learn about charitable giving and be a part of awarding $5,000 to groups in our community? Stop in the guidance office for more information. The Dog Pound School Store is selling Halloween candy grams. The cost of the candy gram is $1. Candy grams can be purchased during A, B, and C lunch periods. The spooky treats will be delivered and distributed during homeroom on Friday, October 29th. Teen Center announcements. Save the date, on Sunday, October 24th, the Teen Center is hosting a Halloween carnival open to the public. There will be food trucks galore, a bounce house, face painting, as well as a lot of fun Halloween-themed games, including the dime pitch, soda ring, toss game, fish bowl game, and lots more. Well, that's it for today's episode. To conclude, we'll leave you with today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Bailey Heidley and Kyle Smith. 